King Charles was visibly upset after his cancer diagnosis, especially given the strained relationship between his sons, Prince William and Prince Harry, according to royal correspondent Russell Mears. During his appearance on the ITV show Lorraine, Mears discussed King Charles's emotional state and how the royal family is coping with the news. He urged viewers of Royal Postmail to subscribe and enable notifications to keep abreast of all updates concerning the British royal family. Mears observed that King Charles, who seemed quite emotional during his recent visit to Sandringham, is in constant touch with his elder son, Prince William. Prince Harry, his younger son, flew in from the United States yesterday to be with his father. However, Mears expressed doubts about a reconciliation between the brothers despite the challenging times for the family. The royal expert opined that the brothers' relationship has hit a low point and may not improve even in light of their father's health crisis. King Charles was photographed looking visibly emotional while being driven to Buckingham Palace, lending credence to Mears' assertions. He added that King Charles's recent meeting with Prince Harry was of high significance, considering Harry hadn't visited when his father was being treated for an enlarged prostate. The length of Prince Harry's stay in the UK, while his wife Meghan Markle and their children Archie, 4, and Lily, 2, remain in the US, is yet to be determined. Mears pondered whether Prince Harry would extend his stay, given the strained relationship with his brother, Prince William. Lorraine Kelly, the show's host, chimed in, suggesting that if the brothers didn't reconcile now, they possibly never would. Mears concurred, stating the relationship was essentially at a low point and the only chance of reconciliation might be between Prince Harry and his father. Prince Harry's recent trip to the UK to support his unwell father, King Charles, underscored his estrangement from the royal family. A request to stay at his uncle Edward's residence, Bagshot Park, was bluntly refused, highlighting Harry's ongoing familial tension. Harry's decision to relocate to the US with his wife Meghan, coupled with his various media engagements and revealing memoir, has only fueled controversy. His memoir, co-authored with Meghan, shared personal struggles and criticisms of the royal family, sparking public debate and increasing discord. Further complications arose when UK authorities revoked Harry's security detail and denied Meghan entry due to public order concerns. Negotiations for a compromise proved fruitless, leaving Harry vulnerable to media attention and public harassment. Even attempts to seek refuge at Frogmore Cottage, a property gifted by the late Queen Elizabeth II, were thwarted by his aunt, Princess Anne. However, the situation isn't simply black and white. While Harry's actions have garnered criticism, with accusations of exploiting his royal status for personal gain and being overly influenced by Meghan, it's necessary to consider the emotional complexities and personal struggles behind his decisions. Caught at a crossroads, Harry is pressured by public opinion, family discord, and his personal convictions. His path forward remains uncertain.